Dr. Susan Munch is examining mosses and liverworts on a property along a brook in Wayne County, Pennsylvania. Munch is one of 18 scientists on seven teams of researchers participating in the 2021 BioBlitz. One of the reasons I asked what the pH of the soil was is that I've often found that um, I'm more likely to find a higher diversity of liverworts on acid soil. And since so far, I haven't seen any. <laughs> this year's event is being held at an undisclosed location. As part of the COVID-19 precautions, each team will be visiting the site at separate times and posting their findings online. This area provides important habitats such as forests, wetlands, grasslands, and streams. This one is almost certainly Hypnum imponens. It has the leaves that curl. It's a little, a little more recognizable than the other Hypnum species. Scientists have also spent time searching the wetlands and woods for amphibians and reptiles. The goal of the BioBlitz is introducing people, especially children, to scientists working in the field and sharing the treasures of the natural world. This year's BioBlitz also highlights a diverse and fragile environment in an area under pressure. There is a legal challenge to the current ban on fracking in the Delaware River watershed. The ban is aimed at protecting an ecologically important watershed, that's the drinking water supply, for 17 million people. The organizers say there is the possibility of a public event linked to the BioBlitz later this year.